crash the last time. Is it crashing? No, it's filming. It's a, it's a, it has a timer going. Yeah. I did not know you were wearing a brown shirt. In my head, when I just saw the other video, you had a red shirt on. What the fuck? I just had a mind fucking break. Okay. You okay? Did I just get the shirt Babe, well, I thought you had a red shirt all right, on. Alright, then. Hey, you it just, me I up. think he just went back in time. Something, I don't know, something like that was just really weird. That's weird. Are we filming something? What yeah. are we doing? Okay. Welcome, babe. Welcome, Welcome. to the show. This is Co-Ghost. Co uh, guess. I swear he had a red shirt on. I don't know what just happened. I teleported. I came from the past. That was weird. Okay. You ready? Yep. Alright. Well, go! Why are you looking at me? <laughs> oh my god, I hate doing this. Why? This is so oh, embarrassing. No, no, no. This is the log. It's your turn. No! Oh my god. Just, hi. Nope. You gotta agree. I'm not doing it. You already told me like that and it's so embarrassing. You tried very hard and I loved it. No, we're gonna talk about Berserk anime. All right, hey, not the remake, the original. The original, nineteen ninety-seven, yes. born in, in the year nineteen ninety-seven, by some studio I don't know. Uh, so Berserk, it's good shit. It's, it is uh, fucking about twenty years old. Perfect. It is a really fucking good anime. I loved it. I loved every second yeah. of it. I actually missed like the first three episodes because I was like, yeah, I, I watched one episode and waited like a week, then watched the second episode. I was doing something at the time, but when I came into yeah. it, it was when. Guts had just met, five yeah he had just met Griffith yeah and I was like look at this guy with the yeah. white hair this this guy's too beautiful to be in this fucking gory brutal yeah. anime what is yeah. I'm intrigued I have to see what's exactly. gonna happen so yeah this anime, um, also and it's the only anime I've ever seen in my entire life where it's a black woman as a main character and I fucking yeah. loved it that's pretty good loved it it's a good feature yes but uh yeah it's just like um so Guts well okay the show starts off like in the future like already giving you like some uh, taste of what to expect. But also plays with you a little bit because it shows you some things that like you're like okay so obviously we know he's gonna get a crossbow, we know he's gonna have one eye closed like they they hinted at a lot of stuff. Yeah, see, I had, didn't see the first episode, so I didn't know he had yeah. no arm and no. And eye. I completely forgot about it yeah. for half the series, and then like right when I had that final episode, I was like, oh shit, that makes a lot of sense. But um, so yeah, they do a time skip. Um, they they hint at a character named Griffith though in the first episode. And so you're like, okay, we gotta Who go figure out what the fuck's a Griffith. So the, also in the jump back in time, they do like a like a, a origin story sort of like so like Griffith or not Griffith, uh, Guts is the main character. He's like this big brutal guy with a big sword. He's awesome. But then you get to see like, okay, so he was a little kid. Yeah, and, I saw that part uh, where he was with the mercenaries yeah. and that guy was so jealous of him. Yeah. He tried to kill him. So we find out like, okay, so this kid, he's raised by mercenaries. He becomes an amazing soldier. His parents were murdered. Um, his parents was. They found him like on a battlefield next to his dead parents. His mom was hanging from his a tree. His mom was hanging from a tree, which they don't explain fun. in the anime, but no. But the atmosphere is so good, it's yeah. disgusting. Yeah, yeah. So it's like a burning sky, and it's like everything in the forefront is black, and it's yeah. really fucked. I like. That. Yeah, it's good. So yeah, he's raised by mercenaries. Instantly, war. He loves war. He only knows how to kill. He only knows how to kill. That's his thing. Um, so we skip a few more years. He's now a teenager. Um, he's going from like battle to the battlefield, just getting bounties for killing people. And then he meets the um, the what are they, the hawks? Yes, band of yeah, hawks. The band of hawks comes across these guys. A um, bunch of their like grunts are jealous that he's like getting rewards left and right. So they're like, let's go kill him. But now were you in the room for that part? Nope, I still wasn't there yet. Okay. Yeah. All right. So like, basically, these guys start a fight with the main character. The main character whoops the shit. I out literally of them. came into the show is when he was fighting Griffith. They were dueling, right? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, they they start a fight. Um, we're introduced to Griffith, who's like this white-haired, feminine-looking man. He's very uh very good with a sword, very strong, very leaderly. Um, um so intense facial expressions, it's unbelievable. Yeah, he's got some of the best facial expressions I've ever, ever seen. seen. Ever seen. Um. So basically, uh, long long plot short, uh, Guts has to join up with them um, for reasons, and then yeah, we don't want to spoil everything. Yeah, he he basically it, he comes to like this point where he's just he's thinking like, what does he really want in life? What is his purpose? Yeah, existential and like crazy all over the place. He has these in intense moments of like aloneness where he's just yeah. contemplating everything he's been through, yep. what he wants from the future. Yep. And um, he's such a unique character though because he's like so like selfless and like. I don't know. He has this deep like kindness in him, yeah. which is so. I'm going interested in seeing all the fighting because it's extremely brutal and gory, which is 
fucking awesome. It looks yeah. great. Such a good looking. Oh my god! If you like Kill Bill and you love Out of Control, Over the Top Blonde, you're gonna live for this. Uh, live for it. You like big swords? You'll love it. Um, yeah. So what were we saying? But yeah. So uh, to see this extremely brutal man that grew up in this like hideous world, yeah. uh, you know, hopelessness. Everything's fighting in war. So he has these incredibly like beautiful like touching moments. Like it just shocks you like yeah. you're shocked when you see these things and they always play the same fucking like song weird, like uh like I, weird like uh, enya chanting uh yeah. kind of like sex music in a movie i don't know like it's sex shit. shit but it fits every time you, yeah. you hear that music you're like oh my god you know something's Something, gonna happen something's good some emotional shit's gonna happen someone's gonna start crying yeah. it's gonna be bullshit and it was so good it's pretty sweet this anime literally has no filler it's Atmosphere from episode one until the last episode continues unbroken. Yeah. It's the only time I've ever seen that. Ever. Yeah. Because it, it, I love shit like even like Death Note and like Evangelion and stuff like that. And they have their shit episodes where it's filler bullshit. Yeah. Stuff that's pointless. That doesn't, it doesn't like further the story of the characters at all. And this show didn't have any of that. The only problem with the show is they like, uh, it, it feels short. Like every mm -hmm. episode feels short. So, every episode is only 20 minutes. Yeah, so you go through an episode and you're just kind of like, fuck. They always have to end it like at a good point. They do. They always end it really yeah. good. It fades to black. Yep. Um, but uh, yeah, just the, the the overall pacing is really good and the character development. Yep, is really and it's good. one of the only shows where they say the characters' names a lot, so you don't forget their names because I always forget people's names, yeah. and we know all the guys' came names in this. Pippin. Yep. Pippin. Yep. And, uh, Krakus. Yep. Um, <laughs> what was that his name? Darkus. Dorcus. No, Corcus. Corcus. That's it. Hideous name. Hideous. Disgusting name. Rick Rickert. Rickert. That was weird. Cause I thought it was Ricketts, but uh, it was Rickerts. He's a little kid. What was the girl's name? Sir uh, Circus. Circus. Babe, do you know how I just said we just remember the name and you can't remember? I, the name? I was just thinking about the name too. What the fuck was it? You just fucked me over because I can't remember her name either. Casca. Casca. Yeah. Yeah. I know all the names. He fucked me up when he doesn't remember because yeah. I forget. Guts is good. Yep. Kafka gets good. Um. Listen. Kefkik? What's the what's the white-haired guy's name again? Griffin! <laughs> I'm an old Listen, I'll need to do the review. Um, right, there you go. The animation, listen, the animation is exceptional. Yeah. Some scenes will blow your mind. You can't even understand how they put this much detail in a fucking human face. And then the next scene will be a horse that looks like a, a pig. It doesn't, it's so bad. Yeah. It goes from pure excellence to shit in like a second and then uh, right back. The horse back. animations are shit. The worst of the Probably, some of the, worst. Probably some of the worst. Probably some of the worst I've ever seen. Yep. And they cannot do animals at all in this anime. Yeah. I don't know what the budget was on this anime. But the but... humans are magnificent. Even the uh, anatomically, like their bodies and everything, they get all of the really good muscles. Yeah. These guys are wicked ripped. These are like Ronnie Coleman men. Ron, Ronnie well, the, Coleman The cool thing is, like, there's a lot of diversity. Yep, them, so. there is. They're skinny. Not only bigs. between the, the, like, the, the generic knights, like, all of the armors never look the same. No, all the faces look different. You have yeah. fat faces, yeah, skinny faces, old soldiers. people. The um even when you get to the demon parts, like oh. when they start showing demons. Oh, that's so fucked up. Uh, the demons are fucking... There will be a time in this anime where shit goes so off the deep end you yeah. don't you can't even you uh, cannot see it coming. Let's just say yeah, it comes out of nowhere mm -hmm. and you're like, what the, what the fuck is going on here? I mean obviously if you read the manga first, yeah. you watch the know. anime first, then we'll go I have we're gonna read it after this. We haven't yeah. seen it, read it, but it looks great. Yeah, that sounds good. Um, Loved it. Ten out of ten. Perfect. Literally it's on my list of like top five five ever anime yeah. ever. I w yeah, I think I would give it a 3 out of 3. Mine's definitely. Yeah, it's perfect. It's. It, I won't say it's a perfect anime, but it's as close as you can get to perfect. It was perfect for me. The only problem is 25 episodes, they don't quite wrap it up as good as they could have. But that's not. But see, but we didn't read it, so we don't really know. Yeah, this, this is kind of like a taste of it, I guess. It's going to leave you wanting more. They could totally do a sequel to this show. Yep. And, but I don't uh, want him to because yeah, it'll probably suck ass. Probably not would suck ass, but had they continued it back when it probably would have been really cool. But there's three movies. There's I three think movies. three or four I, and I don't know if they add more to the story, but from what yeah. I understand they're just retellings of the story. Well because I understand one details, of the movies so. is one of the most important parts of the anime is when they finally get knighted. Like they're the yeah. highest rank ever. They go from commoner plebeians. Mercenaries. To, yeah. To shit thieves. So sir, sir Guts. To sir, literally a nobleman. Yep. Yeah. And Royalty. that scene is really awesome. Like that yeah. entire. It's like a Game of Thrones light. Like, oh, absolutely. Uh, this is a Japanese Game of Thrones. It's very political light. It, like there's there's politics, but there's it's not to the degree. In Game it's of easy Thrones, to understand. Everyone's backstabbing each other. Um, exactly. But it's no, there's no like complications with the story. Like. Yeah. 
But not in a bad way. I don't mean that in a bad way. Like, it's not simple enough where you feel like it's you're a baby watching it. But it's also not too complicated where you're like, oh, there's 900 fucking stupid characters, all these side assholes, side plots going on. No, it's a condensed idea that they just executed the whole thing. And I loved it. There's no... The music, there's no, like, stupid rock music thrown in or any, like, fucking J shit no. that I hate when they put into animes. It's just uh, one the, the idea. The opening sucks. Don't, well, if you watch it online, then it's the places we did, you won't even see it. Yeah. We never, um, I never saw Unfortunately, it. it's hard as fuck to find this anime, so you, you're going to have to watch it online. I couldn't find it on any streaming sites. If um, you want to buy it, it's about $800. Yeah, the, uh, if you go to Amazon, the DVD is, like, 900 bucks. <laughs> It's, I don't know why. What are you looking at? I'm seeing if the uh, the movies actually add more to it. No, that one came out in 2000, what, 13, yeah, babe? Two of them came out in 2012, one came out in 2013. I don't know if I want to see anything that's that recent. I have a huge distaste of modern anime. I don't like it at all. I, can't wa I can watch almost nothing that has come out probably in the last 10 to 14 years, I'd say. I can't. Anything from like 2000 onwards, I don't really like. So it sounds like the movie deviates a little bit from the anime. Um. But uh, we're definitely gonna have to check that out. Yeah. What the fuck was I just gonna say? Um, that sounds pretty sweet. And when I was watching this, the character development that comes between the, f the three main characters of Casca and Griff and fucking um, Guts is extremely Anne Rice. Like, it's something literally... Yeah. It reminded me so much of, like, the Vampire Chronicles that was obscene. It's very homoerotic in some parts. It's very... Yeah. It's torturous. Like, it's torturous to watch, like, what these characters, like, how they treat one another. Because it's, like... It's just straining. It's yeah. straining sometimes. You want things to happen that don't happen. Let's just say it. It's it, it gets very gay between each other. Oh, it's gay. It's, oh, the whole thing's gay. It's so good. Though. Yeah. Oh, it's the best. That's what I'm saying. Read Anne Rice. If you yeah. like this, every single person watching this, if you haven't fucking read Anne Rice, go read it. Okay? You have no. You are missing out on something that is so good you don't even know. Yeah. Uh, what is it called? Vampire The va These are the Vampire Chronicles, but I only recommend really reading the Vampire Lestat and yeah. uh, Interview the Vampire. Those are the first two? Yes. Okay. After that goes, it's it really stars. deviates. Yeah. Anyone that doesn't know that, I don't know where the fuck you guys have been living for the last whenever. Yeah. But, yeah. It, it had a extreme, like, tones. When was this? 80s? 90s? And I started writing that in the 70s. 70s. The interview with the vampire. Okay. Yep. It's great. Yeah. Guts and Griffith are like Lestat and Louis. They have extreme, like, similarities. That's what it makes me, that's what it made me feel like. It's pretty badass. No, it's, Guts is definitely one of my top anime characters. Oh, now. ever! Um, he's just so fucking nice. Yeah, these characters are not one-dimensional. And yeah. that's, like, the greatest part. You think, oh, it's, oh, it's gonna be fucking muscle man, uh, yeah. bullshit, everybody's just gonna be fighting, it's just gonna be a pure fighting action anime, and it's not. It's totally yeah. not that. But the action that is there is good. Oh, it's so good. You can't, you live, you wanna uh, see what people's... One hit kills Oh my god, people's everyone. face is getting cut in uh, half. Horse, a horse, horse head, head cut off and it's still running with yep. no head. Oh my god, it's so good. Uh, eyeballs getting popped. The most disgusting is fucking nastiest demons you've ever seen in your yeah. life. Hideous you shit. You like them? Uh, live, I live for Vaginas, it. there's a... Pierced vaginas, there's, there's rape breast, in this. There's a lot of shit nipples, going down. Uh... There's some children getting... Ch uh, child molesters. Yeah, child, uh, wicked uh, pedophilia out of control. Having sex for money for your army. Um, prostituting yourself for money. That? How fucked up is that? It's great. No, this Can is realistic that? shit that yeah. happened in wartime. Like a 16-year-old boy has to have sex with a... a it was about, a, a, about 50 year old man. Yeah, yeah. For fucking money. Like, that's fucked. And it was a lot of money. Yeah, it was a lot of money, yeah. Oh, don't worry. It all comes full circle. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's some wild shit. It's good shit. Fantastic. The It has such a good pace. It doesn't, it's not over the top. It's just always this really good pace that you want to keep watching more, but it's not like, oh, this is so yeah. fucking unbelievable, or like, oh, this is so boring. It's perfectly in the middle. Yeah. So, that's, I loved it. It's good loved shit. Loved it! It's good shit. It was so bad that when he was at work the other night, I just wanted to watch it without him and pretend like I didn't watch it, but I couldn't do it. Yeah, you went to bed. I'll sleep. <laughs> but, yep. So now we're going to watch Vampire Hunter D. Bloodlust. We need tacos. Because I said that that's like, <laughs> that's an extremely close movie to what we just watched. I love you. We just mowed the lawn. It was about 97 degrees. Saved five toads. Yep. I'm getting really good at hula hooping. And I'm, we just took a shower. That's why I look like complete shit right now. But it was a fantastic anime.
Okay, goodbye. All right, goodbye.